What's up you guys? Salty Skunk Fishing here and there's a siren in the back. <laughs> What's up guys? Salty Skunk Fishing here. Today we went fishing in the surf and I went with my buddy Alex and Mike. It was Alex's birthday and he hooked up with a perch. Mike hooked up with his first surf striper and it was only his second attempt. So I've been trying for a while now. I've still yet to catch a striper from the surf. But he caught it on his second attempt. What gives, right? And so it seems to be the trend that I'm taking people out to my favorite spots and they're totally out fishing me. So welcome to Brian's Fishing Tours. Uh, but today we have a catch and cook plan for you guys. Uh, right now we're gonna go ahead and clean the catch and get it ready for cooking. We're gonna go to my buddy Don's house and throw it on the grill. And we'll show you guys what that tastes like. But without any further ado, let's dive right into it and see the footage from today. Big fish, big fish. Ginormous. Dang. That's a red tail, right? Kind of? Yeah, it's a red tail, I think. It's kind of pinkish on the, on the fins. So since Mike caught this fish, Mike is the one that gets to decide how he's going to cook it. So what are we doing today, Mike? You don't know? I don't know. What have, what have people not done before? We'll, uh, we'll do some, some Cajun seasoning today. Some Cajun seasoning today. I think we should bake it. What do you think, Mike? Yeah, we'll wrap it in foil and shake it Yeah, let's do that. Sand crabs. Yep. Look at that. Sand crabs. Proof positive. Sand crabs work as bait. So first we're gonna go ahead and cut lemons. This is gonna go on and inside of the fish. Next, we're gonna smash up some garlic. Alright, so we got some old bay. We got some lemon pepper. Some paprika. And some onion powder. And a little bit of black pepper. A little bit of garlic oil on the top. garlic into the body cavity and some lemons as well. Sprinkle a little bit of the seasoning inside. Sprinkle 
throw some of the seasoning on top. Sprinkle some seasoning on the skin on both sides. And let's not forget the most important ingredient here, butter. Lay the rest of the lemons and the garlics on top. And top it all off with some more butter. Okay, now it's time to wrap it all up. Alright, so we're doing two layers of aluminum foil on the top and two layers on the bottom, just to be safe. Alright, this thing is ready for the grill. Let's head on over to Don's house, throw it on the grill, and then eat it. Alright. I don't know if you guys can see this because it's getting dark outside. How can I? Is it on? Yeah, turn on the propane. Oh shit! <laughs> you connected the whole thing, remember? <laughs> yeah. I know this, this is all you. There you go. All right. There we go. Boom. All right, Robert. Hey, tell me how heavy you think that fish is. Six to eight pounds. Six to eight pounds. All right. Do you all know right. The weight? I actually don't. <laughs> we just got a scale, so we just weigh ourselves first, and then we give someone to hold the weight of the fish, calculate the difference, and we got the scale for it. You're so smart. I'm trying right. He is. Whoa. You tell everyone. Oh, yeah. you... <laughs> <laughs> 158.8. No, you you let like yourself and you pull the fish out. All right. Wait, this... wait, 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 wait. There you go. Go ahead. All right. 164.8. How much did you prior? 6.2. Yeah. That was pretty close. All right. It's ready to go. Let's throw this baby on the grill. <laughs> it doesn't fit on the grill. Hey, can you bend it? Yeah. Use the tongs. Oh, there we go. Because that's the head. All right. Close the grill. And we'll just wait now. So we don't really know what we're doing. And it's been 20 minutes and we're just gonna flip it. And then uh, we'll leave it for 10 more minutes and we'll see what happens. All right, thank you Don so much for letting us use your house and Liz. Uh, so let's Thanks check. Liz. Let's, Thanks, Liz. <laughs> let's check out what this fish looks like. We have no idea what we're doing, but we hope it tastes good. All right, Mike, crack it open. Dang. <laughs> 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 uh, we didn't know what we're doing, but that looks like it's done right. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Just get in there. Try a piece. It's very um, juicy. All right, let's give it a shot. Cheers. <laughs> How does it taste? Does it taste like fish? <laughs> <laughs> That's good. It's definitely Cajun for sure. 100%. Any white fish, man, he needs a mountain dude. Yeah. No matter what color it is. Oh, that's smooth. Forget the camera's still on. Alright, guys. <laughs> Thank you, Robert. No problem. Yeah. Oh, no, they're, they're filming something. All right, guys, so one of the most important things about eating fish is having something good to wash it down with. So we're washing it down with Hennessy. Hennessy! 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 XO!